Hanwha Ocean shows FFX Batch 2, Thai Frigate and Ocean 4300 concept at IODS 2024. Korean builder Hanwha Ocean at the Indian Ocean Defense and Security Conference in Perth presented a range of frigates including FFX Batch 2. The approach underscored Hanwha's shipbuilding know-how, international experience and flexibility of their baseline design proposed for the Australian C-3000 requirement. As Naval News has illustrated through coverage of the various displays at IODS 2024, the ongoing and much debated C-3000 effort to build 11 general-purpose frigates for the Royal Australian Navy was a significant theme among exhibitors at the event. In this context Hanwha Ocean formerly DSME, one of two Korean competitors for the effort together with Hyundai Heavy Industries HHI, showed the FFX Batch 2 frigate. The design is also known as Daegu class in Korean service. Two additional models were part of the display. One of which was the Thai Bumibal Atul Yacht Edge class frigate, which DSME originally delivered in 2019. The final model was a new proposal by Hanwha, termed the Ocean 4300 frigate. FFX Batch 2 Characteristics Detailed Hanwha Ocean was in charge of the detailed design and construction of the lead ship for the FFX Batch 2 program. The ROKN has introduced 8 Batch 2 as Daegu class between 2018 and 2023, of which half were built by Hanwha and the other half by HHI. Together with the HHI developed FFX Batch 3 the Daegu class is one of the exemplars for C-3000. The Daegu class is 122 meters long with a beam of 14 meters. Full load displacement is 3,600 tons. Missile armament on the ships is a 16-cell KVLS for launching the KSOM short-range air defense missile. Daegu also carries two quadruple launchers for Korean Sea Star SSM-700 series ASHM and two triple launchers for Korean lightweight ASW torpedoes. Armament is rounded out by an American MK-45 5-inch 127mm main gun and the Phalanx 20mm CIWS. The ship has a cruise range of 4,500 nautical miles. Propulsion is of the combined diesel-electric or gas turbine codlog variety, similar to HHIS Batch 3 design. Thai FFX Batch 2 variant illustrates alternate armament options. The Thai ship shown at IODS 2024 illustrates the flexibility of the baseline design also accommodating considerable adapt ions in armament and propulsion. The Bumibal Atul Yacht Edge is 2 meters longer and 100 tons heavier than FFX Batch 2. Armament includes an 8-cell MK-41 VLS for quad-packed ESSM and RUM-139 Ashrock. ASHM carried our harpoon, the main gun is a 76mm Leonardo Super Rapid 230mm autocannons by MSI Defense can engage surface targets at close range. For ASW duty the Thai ship carries MK-54 lightweight torpedoes and provides deck and hangar space for an MH-60R or similar helicopter. Sensor and combat management system illustrate the heavy focus on SOB provided technology. The medium and long range radars carried are the Sea Giraffe 4 aaesa and AMB PESA. The CMS is the SOB 9LV also used by RAN on their ANZAC class in an earlier iteration. Propulsion is the final notable aspect, as the Thai ship uses a combined diesel and gas turbine setup coating. The gas turbine used is GESLM 2500, unlike on FFX Batch 2 and 3, which use the RRMT-30. Ocean 4300 frigate tailored to Australian expectations. Last but not least Hanwha showed the Ocean 4300 frigate. As Hanwha Ocean Ophical Scott KOH explained to Naval News, Ocean 4300 is a modified FFX Batch 2 integrating the Thai frigate armament. The stated aim of the new proposal is to improve interoperability with the Royal Australian Navy. 
As a result the concept drops KVLS and instead features a 32 cell MK41. Propulsion and other basic features are similar to FFX Batch 2.